NATO has turned Vilnius into a fortress defended by advanced weaponry to protect U.S. President Joe Biden and other alliance leaders meeting next week only 32 kilometers from Lithuania's razor wire topped border fence with Russian ally Belarus. Lithuania has tripled the deployment of border guards at the Belarus and Russian borders for the summer, augmented by officers from Latvia and Poland. The two countries have also sent police to help patrol Vilnius. At villages next to the Belarus border, locals told Reuters they feel totally safe, despite the Russian allies' offer to accommodate Russia's private Wagner militia and its hosting of Russian nuclear weapons. At Vilnius airport, eight German-operated Patriot missile launchers were seen standing with their nozzles pointed in the direction of Russia's Kaliningrad. Two more pointed towards Belarus. All of the launchers were operational since Friday morning. The situation is really very tense because of uh, aggression of Russian Federation against Ukraine. So it's already on a very, very uh, high level. And definitely um, uh, these threats of Lukashenko's regime to use the nuclear uh, weapons against the whole world uh, really uh, creates a lot of, uh, uh, I would say, concerns. And this is why we're talking about uh, very strong additional security measures. And what you mentioned and asked about the presence of our allies uh, is one of those very important things. We still can expect a uh, certain provocation in terms of uh, regular migration. Uh, bigger groups can be uh, formed and then pushed to our territory. Uh, as well, there might be um, uh, intentional uh, border violations um, by persons or by military staff in order to check the uh, capability uh, to react of uh, lithium border guards as well as you sometimes may see certain uh, military equipment at the border. Uh, so far we don't see uh, this kind of activity. Again, uh, I will repeat myself, we do not observe any unusual activities at the border with Belarus as well as Russian Federation. Была бы, может, Литва одна, но другое дело. Гекай, здоровняу. Yra visiškai normalios pajėgos, juk atvažiuoja, 
40 valstybių lyderiai, atvažiuojant į Amerikos valstybių prezidentas ir kiti NATO sąjungininkų vadovai, taip kad būtų daugiau negu neatsakinga turėti neapgintą dangų. Bet man svarbiausia, kad mūsų žmonės būtų apginti ir tada, kai vadovai išvažiuos. Tai šitą prasme dar mums tikrai reikia padirbėti, bet aš labai optimistiškai žiūriu į priekį.